What's going on, man? It's your big brother, Trend. You tuned in again to another, another suggested video that I got from an email. A guy, he asked me a question. He said, Trend, I know I can't be the only one going through this, but why are modern women so angry and so bitter nowadays? And he wrote like this long little paragraph or whatever. He was like, telling me uh stories about like you know situations with him and you know girls that he might that he like I guess and um how you know he was just telling me the truth it sounded like I mean I know the truth when somebody writing the truth versus just complaining so I'm about to tell y'all in this video no as a matter of fact I'm not gonna tell y'all anything I just really want y'all to comment below your opinion on this topic all right um and again, ladies subscribers out there, if you subscribe to me and you're a woman, you know I'm not talking about all women, okay? I'm not talking, when I, when I make my little remarks, I'm not talking about all women. I don't hate women. You know what I'm saying? I've dated plenty of women. I do not hate women, okay? But at some point in time, you got to come up, you got to ask questions, because I'm seeing this way too often. And even with the, the woman who I had a call with this morning on my first call, who booked a session with me, she an older woman. And she married. And she sounded like she got good sense. You know, she was nice on the phone. She was polite. She was asking me questions. She was letting me talk. And I have to say, shout out to you if you're watching this video right now. I'm not going to say no names, but it was a wonderful session this morning when I woke up this morning with my first client. She is not like most of these girls I'm about to talk about because I can already tell by the way she talked to me. I can already tell. So again, I'm not talking about all women. I'm talking about a, a high percentage of women who are out here nowadays called modern day women who are very, very angry, bitter, upset about everything. It, it's almost like the, some of these women, it, it's like they got the spirit of the devil or something, man. It's just that bad, okay? But again, don't let this message trigger you because, again, I'm not trying to bash women. I'm not trying to bash no race of women. I'm just asking questions, and we want answers, all right? But I'm doing good, man. It's still Thursday, man, September the 19th. Um, I just got back from the gym earlier and uh, had to go in there. It makes you feel good just going in the gym. Just being in the environment of the gym just is motivational. Like you're doing something good with your life. You know what I'm saying? Like, So I try to hit the gym every day, sometimes two times a day. Sometimes I don't even lift weights. Sometimes I just go in, might jump in the pool, or I might go in the 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 spa or the sauna and just sit in there for like 30 minutes and then leave. But um that's where I just came from. But I had to stop at Jason Deli. I just got me one of them uh Southwest bowls, man. Them things be banging. So if I burp or something and you know I just got through drinking water and eat my salads. I'm addicted to salads by the way. I can't, I gotta have me one every week. You know what I mean? But anyway, uh let's talk about this topic real quick. Why are modern women so angry and so bitter nowadays they are so mean and i know this to be true because i've had so many i've been on this platform i've had a chance to talk to so many people man you know thanks by the thanks thank god for the opportunity i get to talk to all kinds of women and excuse me i get to talk to all kind of men but I, I have to say, with all due respect, my worst, some of my worst subscribers and followers have been women. Women. I've had more women disrespect me than a man ever has in this on this platform. Uh, I was just talking to a girl who who be t she be reaching out to me every blue moon. She she be for some strange reason she'll always find how to get in contact with me through some type of message app. She mean as I don't know what man. 
I'm telling you, man, I, I, I can't even, if I show y'all text messages and screenshots, which I'm not going to do, I keep things secret and private. You would, man, y'all, it will blow your mind how many women send me toxic messages, man. Even in my comment section. Most of the time when I get negative comments on my videos, it don't even be men most of the time. It be women. And it is, it's like, it's becoming like a plague to see all these women out here so mean, so bitter, so angry. It's to the point now, if you a man, you don't even really get, get enthusiastic or you don't even get like, feel like you should even say nothing to these girls nowadays because you already know. Chances are, Nine times out of ten, she going to do something or she going to say something that is going to put you down as a man. It's, she's going to scorn you. She's going to belittle you. She's going to talk down on you in some form or fashion. I, I'm, I guarantee it happened. And this is why a lot of guys do not even, even approach women no more like they used to because it ain't worth the, the squeeze. The juice is not worth the squeeze. You see girls in the gym, they working out privately. These men are not going up to them. They not saying nothing. You feel me? I see it every day. These girls that go out to these lounges and groups and cliques and groves, what the men doing? They is not talking to them. I see it all the time. I seen it this past weekend. Why? Because most of these women, not all of them, but most of these women have grown cold, Bitter, angry. I, as a matter of fact, man, I've heard I've heard, I've heard modern women. They are more profane than any man I ever come across, bro. Me and guys cuss sometimes and talk shit to each other. Don't get me wrong, men do talk smack, but I cannot lie. I've heard women be the most say the most dirtiest, the most hurtful. The most profane things that I ever heard anybody, any man do in my whole life. I've heard it from women more than I heard it from men. That is not cool. This is sad. I don't know what need to happen. I, I don't I don't really know the answer to it. That's why I'm making this video. So my women out there who are awake, who are aware, can give us some answers on why these women are so mean nowadays. Why are they like this? You got men, you got women cussing men out like sailors. They, some of these women, they mouth is so dirty, man. You probably wouldn't even want to get no head by you. I'm just keeping it real, if you know what I mean. It ain't worth, the, the juice ain't worth the squeeze no more. That's what these men are telling me. It ain't worth the headache no more. To take a girl out on a date right now, it's like you got to pay the price of a bitter a bitter date you gotta just and this is why like i say this is why the guys are not approaching women anymore this is why they not even they not even happy about it no they don't even want to get involved because he, he don't know if he gonna she gonna mess him up she don't he don't know if he gonna catch a case he don't she don't he don't know if she gonna Tell the whoever on he don't know what's gonna happen because these girls nowadays, these modern day women, they have become so crazy, so psycho that the juice is not worth the squeeze anymore. And you got guys that's literally stay here in the states, they go into a whole different country into abracadabra just so they can find a sensitive, peaceful, easygoing, slow to anger, laid back. Quiet, pleasant, feminine woman. This is what guys have to do now because most of the modern day women here are so freaking angry. It's, it's ridiculous. And I don't get it. I don't understand why. Girls have more opportunities than they ever did before nowadays. Girls have the same damn opportunities as basically men nowadays when it comes to work. As a woman, you can make however much money you want because it's, it's no limit no more. It's not a glass window no more. Women can do anything. You look, you got a Kamala Harris running for president right now. When has that ever happened? Women today got more opportunities than some men do. So it, what's the problem? Why are these girls so upset? 
Men is not easy. Men is not hard to please. Men are not sophisticated like women. Trust me. Ladies, fellas, y'all speak up, let your voice Mary leave a comment below. I want to know what you think. Men are not sophisticated like women. Ladies, they not. A man don't need this, that, this, that, and the third, and this, and that, and this to be like this, and for you to say this to him, and for you to treat him. He don't, most men is very simple and basic. They don't want nothing but peace after work. Simple. They don't want nothing but sandwiches. A nice little, nice little, nice little small size dinner. Not you don't even gotta know how to be a cook. He ain't even really asking you to be a cook. He just like, dang, can you make me a sandwich or something? I'm hungry. I like to eat, baby. That's all he want. That's all men want. Somebody to bring peace into their life. If he got with this girl, he got with this woman, he can go hang with this woman and 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 be cool and chill, sit back, kick his kick his legs up, watch football. You know what I mean? Be free, ha be happy, being around her energy, make them calm, make them happy, relaxed. He every if men should feel comfortable to hang around women, like real comfortable. Like if you got your own house or apartment, if you're a woman out there, that's all he want. He just wants you to come. He just want to come over there and just be chilled out. That's it. If you give him some, that's a plus. That's an addition. That's good too, but he don't necessarily want that if the attitude ain't even right. If the attitude is perfect and a woman's emotions are in balance with her masculine side versus too much masculine and then this little bit of femininity, he can't do that. Men can't deal with aggressive women, ladies. It's not in our nature to argue with women. And it just, it blows my mind how much feedback I get on whether that's email, whether that's text messages, whether that's me meeting a girl that I potentially might want to date, how much negative stuff that I hear coming from the most delicate thing on earth. That's a woman. Women are supposed to be delicate, soft, feminine, slow to anger. She shouldn't be arguing with you. Ah, ah. But look, I'm I'm lying. I guess I'm lying. I'm making this up. Um, I'm just calling it like I see it. I get calls from most of my women, my women clients. It's the same story. I hear the same story from most women, grown women. What they always say, fellas. I don't hang with no girls. I don't hang with no these. I can't get they. They get on my nerves. I hear the same story from ninety percent of women when I'm talking on phone with, you know, coaching. I hear the same stuff. Why is it like this, lady? Why can't y'all get along with each other? Why can't y'all? Why do y'all hate each other? Why are y'all jealous of each other? Why do y'all get angry with men? Why are y'all so malicious? What happened along the way? What happened with the nice girls attitude? You know, and and you can't be mad at the guys because they just they want to they guys want to find a woman just like men want to find. I mean, like a woman want to find a man, even though he won't say it. Men keep a lot of stuff to themselves that they don't even come out about and complain about. But a lot of guys want to be in relationships, even though they won't say it, because right now they it ain't even worth the squeeze no more. It is not even worth getting with a woman and being in a long-term relationship or a situation with her if if it take one thing to trigger her to where she blank and go out of control. He don't know if he going to lose everything because she got the rights to really do that. Women got more power when it comes to the law than men do. Men are scared to death. They scare out their mind that a woman, if they if they treat treat a woman like a queen or like a princess or something like that, and he give a he 50 50 with her, he's scared she gonna flip on him and take all this, take his kids away from him and screw him over and put him on child support or put him on alimony or get him locked up. It's so many 
things that could happen if he tries to trust the women nowadays, the modern day women nowadays. It ain't even worth it no more. God is like, you know what, bro? I'm better off just being by myself. Hey, I can learn how to cook myself. I can clean my own house. I can wash my own drawers. I, I don't even need a woman at this point. If I got to do all of that, if it come with a, a cost to pay like that, well, like all these other guys who they seen out here doing the Chris Brown and them for money, you know what? I'm good. I'm good. That's what guys are saying. They like, they sitting back. They like, you know what? The juice ain't even worth this. It ain't even worth my energy no more because I'm trying to be peaceful. I'm not trying to argue. I'm not trying to fuss. I'm not trying to fight. I'm not trying to listen to nobody's whims except for my own. And this is why dudes is not talking to girls no more. And all the girl, most of the girls out there say, well, where the good guys at? They, they right, they everywhere. Chill, lay back. I see them in my community. I see them when I go out to grocery stores. You got men in grocery stores shopping like women nowadays, like for bread, for fruit, for salads. Because you know what? It ain't even worth it for them to invest into most of these modern day women. Not all of them, but most of these modern day women. It is it's not even it's not even worth the time and the energy because he just don't want to go through all that that drama. So my question is, what's the problem? I might be wrong. Because I know somebody out there going to come in my comment section and be like, Trent, this is what they're going to say, y'all. This is what people going to say. It goes both ways. That's going to be the number one comment. And then so you're going to have the next top comment. Guys nowadays are gay. They are soft. That's going to be the next top popular excuse that women use, modern day women. Let me come up with a third one. Why don't we come up with a third? Um... Oh, stop, stop. What is it? What they say? Oh, oh, stop, stop. You, you, you playing, you, you just, you a passport, bro. What is a passport, bro? It's just a, basically, it's just a guy who chooses to travel abroad and go to different countries versus staying in this country all forever. That's really all it is. It ain't nothing crazy serious about it. Except for the name passport, bro. It's just a dude that's single and he wants to travel abroad for more options other than where he currently is from or where he resides. That's all it is. And this is not a red pill channel. What the hell is a red pill channel? All these terms people come up with is all just immaturity. It is what it is. Men are tired of angry, bitter women. It's just that simple. It's that simple. I didn't say nothing crazy. I didn't say nothing to bash women. It's just that most men are sick and tired of women who act like masculine pirates. Pirates. Negative, toxic. We, it's just not cool no more. It's just like, okay. If we got a disagreement, cool, we can debate quietly, calmly. Just like the presidential debate. If you got a problem with somebody, you disagree, you sit there, you conduct yourself in an orderly fashion, and you have a simple conversation with the person that you want to debate with. Yeah. But they can't, they, people can't do that no more nowadays because people have become triggered easily. Triggered. Triggered. If you start telling somebody the real truth and giving them the real spill, they'll start insulting you. They'll start belittling you. They'll start calling you out your name. And then that's when the argument don't went totally left field because you got one person cussing another person out when it ain't even that serious. It ain't even that even serious. So what's the problem? Ladies, fellas, what's the problem? I'm not telling y'all this is, this is what I'm experiencing from other people telling me. This is what my girl clients are telling me. This is what ho my homies that follow me. This is what they emailing me. It's not my idea. But even though I do see it going on all the time. Angry women everywhere. Everywhere. I haven't, me personally, I haven't had a beef with a man ever since high school, bro. I remember the last thing, the last problem I had with another guy was when I got in a fight with this dude. At back in high school, who used to ride my bus, he kept messing with me. He kept hitting me and stuff like, 
playing with me too much. I don't know if he was, I don't know if he was fruity. I don't know. I don't care. But that was the last time I ever had an altercation with a grown ass man. Why? Because me, most of the time, men don't act like that to each other. We just kick it and just chill. I could call my buddies up right now if I if I really wanted to, and we can just kick it and we can watch a football game in peace and talk about anything in the world and won't nobody hate nobody, won't nobody have no problems with nobody. It'll be a good day. But if a man call up a woman, which most of the time he want to, he want to kick it with a woman, he want to treat a woman, he want to go hang out with a woman because it's just natural. But he don't want to do that no more because it's just it comes with too much of a headache to hang with a woman on for something simple. It is too much of a headache to take a woman out on a date. I mean, if you do take a woman out on a date, she, you, she must be certified or you think that she could have the potential to be a certified woman. Now, I ain't trying to say every woman that I've dated don't act like this. I don't have really good women that I've dated in the past who have been really cool, really neutral, laid back, never got angry with me, never acted a damn fool, and conducted themselves just as a woman should. Sweet, kind, pleasant, respectful, laid back, quiet, happy. But you know what? I, I, can't, I ain't went on them kind of dates in a long time. You know why? Because I feel where most people coming from. These girls nowadays, they are just so freaking mean, man. It just, it, it's almost like a psychological disorder. It's just running a rampant. They, they, most of these modern, most of them, not all of them, most of these modern day women are just freaking mean and angry, bro. That's the number one thing that I see with most of these girls out here nowadays. They angry at what? I don't know. Angry, bitter, and it's to the point now where guys now live in expectancy. Guys live in expectancy of this type of behavior because it's so normalized now that if a guy got a girl number or if he took her out on that date, he waiting on it to happen, literally. He might not say nothing, but he know it's going to happen eventually because it's like the normality of how it all is with dating now and stuff like that. He know the devil is going to come out eventually. He know it, and he probably right. 99% of the time, it's the same situation with most situationships with men and women. Comment below, fellas, if you know I'm not capping. If you got a good woman, let us know. Comment below. If you a good woman out there, you got some friends, that uh, sister girlfriends and stuff, comment below and let us know if you got real women friends. But I know it ain't going to be a lot of people to be able to say that because most of y'all hate each other. Can't get along. If you a woman out there, you a modern day woman, go ahead and uh, say one of those top three comments that I mentioned early because I know you, that's what you're going to do because you can't do nothing else. Just go ahead and throw me some insults because you can't talk about nothing that really explain nothing that makes sense. So go ahead. If you want to talk down on me and, and say I'm bashing women, say I hate women. If you want to call me gay because I'm sitting up here talking about a problem that exists and we need solutions to. Go ahead and do your insults at the bottom so you can get your five seconds of fame. OK, you want five seconds of fame. Go ahead. Right on at the bottom right now and and. and and make yourself look stupid. Because you definitely watched this video and got my view up. <laughs> so, y'all heard me. Y'all heard me say it. I don't hate women. I'm not bashing women. I said most women. Most of these modern day women are angry, bitter, and very mean. Give this video a thumbs up. It's your big bro, Trim, man. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.